Rich, how old are you? Uh, Richie, dear, we don't ask ladies how old they are. Why not? They won't tell you. Can <laughs> ladies tell their birthday? Well, that they tell. And mine's next Friday, and I need a new shawl for my piano. Which birthday will it be? Well, uh, Rich, <clears throat> come on, let's go now. You say goodnight to Aunt Pickles and Uncle Buddy. Are they married? Yeah, I certainly hope so. <laughs> Where's your husband? Uh, mine? I haven't got one. <laughs> Why don't you get one? <laughs> The whole cast was just so special. Um, Dick, uh, Dick was very cool. Dick, Dick is a very wonderful man. Um, he would, he would um, kind of do his own thing, but he was always just sweet and wonderful. And um, you know, in a way, like a father, but not really. I think I, Mary, between Mary and Rosemary, they were probably the two more of the figures that I felt were more like you know mother figures, especially you know Rosemary because I spent a lot of time with Rosemary and she was so um, just loving to me and she had a daughter, she didn't have a son, so I think that was a really kind of a nice bond and we still keep that together today. And you know I think Mary, in her own way, um, and you know I, she might even tell you this. I think she ever mentioned in her book actually that Mary's not an overly um, affectionate person in you know in terms of things. But I think she looked at me as, as really more of a son than her own son in a lot of ways, because I was around her a lot more than, than her son, Richie. Um, and I think that's kind of an interesting thought when you think about it, because you're, you're together so much all the time. And Maury was just great, and you know, they'd always help me, and they would always be there to, you know, if I had a question, they would help me answer and help me with my performances. And it was just, it was, it was really, um, it was just really a special moment. And you know, as a child, when you, you hear about all the, you know, problems with child stars, and was it traumatic, and was it this and that. And, you know, mine was so untraumatic for a couple of reasons. Uh, one, because of my family, because, you know, when you come from an Italian Catholic family and you got, you know, six brothers and sisters at home and you go home, and it's like, you know what, go clean up the, 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 the yard and go pick up this and make your damn bed, and, da -da 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 -da. and so you, there just was none of that going on. And then on the set, um, again, we were so close and really such like a family that there was just no bad things about it. I, I, I just, I can't think of anything bad about it. Well, it was fun being able to, to just play, you know, I mean, as a kid. You know, here's your part, here's your play, go play Richie. And, and it was so funny because we did the reunion show last year and I had several people come up to me, and Carl especially, uh, as we were doing the scene because of the, the one scene I had was with, with Alan Brady on the phone in the old Petri living room. And he came up to me and says, what have you, have you been doing anything since we did this show? I mean, you know, acting stuff. And I said, well, you know, I said, I'm a salesman. I act every day. And he goes, no, no, I don't know. But, but I mean, have you done anything? I said, well, not, you know, some voice over here and there. I says, no. He says, he goes, you're brilliant. He goes, you're, you're absolutely fan You're wonderful. She goes, I'm so, so impressed. He goes, you're just like a natural. You're so good. And I said, well, thanks. You know, it's partly because of you, because I didn't know. And I think what it is, is that as a child, what they wanted from me was to just be me. So, Richie was me. I didn't. I mean, it, you know, I created it. Was just it, whatever I personified. That was Richie. So that was the character. So for me, it was so easy to go back and just kind of be myself. And I think a lot of us, a lot of the cast, had a lot of that in them. You know, they were being themselves in a lot. Dick is Dick is like he is a lot, as Rob Petrie. Um, in fact, you know, probably the probably the really only well, I, I'd say only, but the most purest of the acting of all of them was Mary. I guess she really was a character actor, and she, you know, but Dick is as great as he is, he was just being Dick. And we were just kind of being ourselves, and that made it fun. Mm -hmm.